Hey everyone and welcome to Steam Powered Family. Today we have a really fun and simple circuit project for you to do with the kids. As you can see here, we're making a very simple paper circuit that has a police car design. And you can see it there lighting up beautifully. And then we also have a second design and that's making a torch or a flashlight. Now these projects, we do provide the templates. They're available through the site. And if you look in the notes below, we do have a link there so that you can go and grab these templates and do this project with your kids or in your classroom. You're gonna to wanna to gather, gather your supplies. You're gonna need some scissors, some tape, a nine volt battery, an LED, and of course, the printable templates. You're also gonna need a graphite pencil. And this we need a 6B or 8B graphite pencil. And you can buy these at art stores, crafting stores, they're quite common. Now we're gonna go through and we're going to color in on the templates. You're gonna to wanna to stay in the design and turn the paper as you're coloring so you don't smear the graphite around the page. You want a nice solid line all the way around that's filled all the way in so our electricity will be able to conduct through the graphite from the battery to the LED and complete our circuit. There we go, beautifully colored. Now we've got our LEDs. We've bent the legs at 90 degree angle so they'll fit perfectly on the page. You'll want to identify which is the positive and which is the negative on both your LED and your nine volt battery to make sure that they're aligned properly in your circuit. Once you've done that, take a little bit of tape and put down, put down the LED so it's nicely secured into the graphite. You want a really nice connection there to make sure that your circuit will work. Now take your battery, make sure it's lined up properly, and there we go, it's working, we have light. Now we can do the same thing with the torch. Now as a little tip here, on an LED, the longer leg is the positive leg and the shorter leg is the negative leg. And on your battery, it'll always be indicated which is the positive and which is the negative terminal. There we go, we've got power again. Doing these simple circuit activities is a wonderful way to help build STEM skills, critical thinking skills, problem solving skills, plus building creativity, as well as learning about electricity and connectivity. Looking for more activity ideas, including more circuits? Make sure you come and check out steampoweredfamily.com for lots of really innovative ideas. Have a great day.